648 here on your Friday morning. Welcome back. Beautiful start to the day. That's a live look from our Steve's Paint Supply camera. As you look up towards Cheyenne Mountain, we're going to see those temperatures warm and be hot again this afternoon. Right now, low 60s to the low 70s, Pueblo and Colorado Springs. It's 59 currently in Salida and 54 this hour in Lyman. Chance for showers and thunderstorms. Minimal today, but I do think we'll see a few roll off the mountains and into the I-25 corridor. A better chance in continuing to see the summer swelter on Saturday afternoon before cooler temperatures come our way with an increasing chance for showers and thunderstorms starting on Sunday. But that ridge of high pressure, at least for the next 48 hours, is going to hold tough. It does begin to elongate somewhat as we go into the day on Saturday, but that westerly flow, you know what that does, a little stronger flow aloft pushes some of those convective showers that form with the lift up and over the mountains and pushes them a little further east across the plains. Now as we go into the day on Sunday, Saturday into Sunday, we're going to see a front come across the area. We're also going to see a trough kind of developing out over the Pacific Northwest, Northern California, Northern Nevada, and all of this combined will bring our temperatures down starting on Sunday and continue to give us pretty mild temperatures through the middle of next week, but hot today at 94, close to 100 here in the springs tomorrow afternoon with isolated to widely scattered showers and thunderstorms, more numerous thunderstorms coming up on Sunday, but we're back into the upper 80s. 101 in Pueblo, 94 for the Springs, 98 Canyon City. Triple digit heat continues out across the plains. No problem here up and through the lunch hour. Mostly sunny skies by 1, 2 o'clock, seeing partly cloudy skies and a few showers and thunderstorms again developing, kind of sliding through Colorado Springs down towards Pueblo. You know, this is an estimate from our computer models. They quickly kind of die out as we go deeper into the evening hours, then clearing skies overnight. Significantly hotter tomorrow afternoon. 107, La Junta Lamar, 104 in Pueblo. There, your upper 90s, Denver, Colorado Springs, and Lyman, and 102 in Canyon City tomorrow afternoon. Now, the difference between 20% and 40% looks like this. Kind of more numerous showers and thunderstorms firing in the mountains and then rolling out into El Paso County, out across the Palmer Divide from Lyman back towards the Parker area. We'll continue to see those showers and thunderstorms into the late afternoon, the early evening hours. And then by late Saturday night, we'll get a bit of clearing, but even some lingering showers out to our east. Woodland Park, here you go. We're warm today and tomorrow, but a 90% chance that you get rain showers and thunderstorms coming up on Sunday. But we're going to back the heat off into the mid-70s, low 70s next week, Wednesday and Thursday. Canyon City at 103 tomorrow afternoon, then the low 90s Sunday, so it's still kind of on the hot side, but we'll back those temperatures off into the upper 80s and low 90s, and finally, by Wednesday and Thursday, in the low and the mid 90s, low and mid 80s, excuse me. Pueblo, 101 today, 104 tomorrow. Overnight lows close to 70, 93 Sunday afternoon, then we're in the 80s and 90s before cooling it off by Thursday into the lower 80s. Colorado Springs again approaching 100 degrees Saturday afternoon. Scattered showers and thunderstorms will cool it off by about 9, 10 degrees coming up Sunday with a high of 87, 85 on Monday. Lingering rain chances through the middle of next week, but look at Thursday, a high of 78 degrees, well below average temperatures by Wednesday of next week.